Imagine the city skyline, bustling and crowded. Cars jammed on the streets, honking away in the gridlock, while people on foot dodge between them, desperately trying to make it to work on time. Now picture this, a sleek train glides above the traffic, effortlessly slicing through the sky. No tracks cluttering the streets, no congestion, no delays. It's not a scene from a sci-fi movie. It's happening right now, in China. Number 10. Skytrain, taking public transport to new heights. It's called the Skytrain, but it's not flying, not exactly. Picture a train suspended from an overhead monorail track, gliding smoothly above the roads below. This isn't just a concept anymore. China has made it real. The Skytrain stretches over a length of 10.5 kilometers and can zip along at 60 kilometers per hour, carrying up to 200 passengers at a time. And get this, the whole system was constructed in just seven months. That's right, they built an aerial train in a fraction of the time it takes to lay down traditional tracks. But why the fuss? Simple. It's about space optimization and safety. With no tracks hogging the ground, there's more room for vehicles and pedestrians. Fewer accidents, less chaos, and a transportation system that floats above the mess. And it doesn't even cost more than building a conventional train. Could this be the future of public transportation around the globe? It's not so much a question of if anymore, but when. Number 9. BYD Yang Wang U8, the SUV that floats. SUVs are popular for their ruggedness and versatility, but have you ever heard of one that can float? China's BYD Yang Wang U8 isn't just another off-road vehicle. Priced at $50,000, this technological marvel can adjust its height by 150 millimeters and can perform a full 360-degree tank turn while stationary. Sounds impressive, right? But there's more. What really sets it apart is its emergency floating mode. Yes, this SUV can float for 30 minutes and move at 3 kilometers per hour, an emergency feature, not for fun river crossings. As soon as it senses danger, the engine shuts off, Windows close, and air conditioning recirculates internally. The sunroof even opens as an emergency exit. It's like the SUV is transforming into a life raft right before your eyes. You have to ask yourself, what else can China possibly do with vehicle design? Number 8. NIO ET9. The car that shakes off snow. Winter driving can be a nightmare, especially with snow piling up on the roof of your car. Now, imagine a car that can simply shake the snow off on its own. NIO's ET9 set in does precisely that. Equipped with an intelligent chassis system and hydraulic suspension, this vehicle has a unique feature. It can sway side to side, like a dog shaking off water, to clear snow from its roof. It doesn't stop there. This car has a dual motor powertrain generating a hopping 77 horsepower. And with a 120 kW battery, you can get up to 255 kilometers of range with just five minutes of fast charging. It's not just a car. It's a technological masterpiece wrapped in luxury. But it makes you think, why haven't others thought of this sooner? Number 7. Ehang 216S, the flying drone taxi. Up next, the skies are calling. The Ehang 216S drone taxi is here to redefine urban mobility. Fully autonomous, powered by electricity, and capable of carrying two passengers, this vehicle promises to make airborne commutes a reality. Its eight pairs of rovers ensure a smooth, stable flight, even if one rotor fails. It soars at speeds of up to 130 kilometers per hour, reaching an altitude ceiling of 3,000 meters. And the noise, minimal, thanks to its electric propulsion. Imagine beating rush hour traffic in a drone taxi, zipping between skyscrapers, it feels like a scene out of a futuristic movie, yet here we are witnessing it unfold. Number 6. GAC GO. The car that can fly. Flying cars have always been the stuff of dreams, but China is bringing that dream into reality with the GAC GO. A single-seat passenger capsule mounted on a low four-wheel chassis. But here's the twist. It also comes with a detachable copter featuring six folding blades. What makes the GUV stand out is its autonomous operation. No manual controls inside the cabin. You set the destination using a tablet interface. And when the vehicle's battery runs low during flight, 
it autonomously flies to a station for recharging. Is this the ultimate answer to personal mobility? We might find out sooner than we think. Number 5. Xpeng X3, the car that drives and flies. Transitioning seamlessly between the road and the sky, the Xpeng X3 sets a new standard for versatility. Weighing in at about 1,000 kilograms, it's equipped with an advanced eight-rotor system for vertical takeoff and landing. Want to drive it like a car? Go ahead. Switch to flight mode, you control it with the steering wheel and gear lever. It's that simple. Once airborne, the X3 can cruise at speeds of 130 kilometers per hour for up to 35 minutes, a car one minute, an aircraft the next. The convenience here is mind-boggling. Could this dual-purpose vehicle be the future of both personal and urban transport? Number 4. Jump Aero J1 for emergency air mobility. When it comes to emergencies, every second counts. Enter the Jump Aero J1, an electric VTOL aircraft designed for quick, silent, and emissions-free flights. Engineered for speed and efficiency, it's set to revolutionize emergency response. Just imagine, a small, agile aircraft sipping through urban environments to reach critical situations. Its quiet operation and ease of control make it ideal not just for emergencies, but potentially for personal urban flights. It's a leap forward in air mobility, offering rapid, reliable solutions when the stakes are high. Number 3. Shane. The Two-Wheeled Marvel. What's the craziest car you can think of? How about a two-wheeled electric car that seats five people? That's the Shane designed by the inventor of the original hoverboard, Shane Chen. Its wheels automatically adjust to keep the car balanced, even at high speeds. This unique design isn't just for show. The shifting center of gravity counters the forces of driving and braking to maintain stability, making it as safe as a four-wheel vehicle. It makes you wonder, are traditional four-wheel cars becoming a thing of the past? Number two, Lazarus LMV 496 the motorbike that flies. Ever dreamt of riding a motorcycle and then taking off into the sky? The Lazarus LMV 496 makes that possible. With four jet engines integrated into each wheel hub, this electric motorbike can transform into a flying vehicle at the flip of a switch. Kerosene-fueled turbines give it a hopping 1,300 horsepower, allowing short flights of around 10 minutes. The price tag a cool half a million dollars. It's the ultimate fusion of motorcycle thrills and aerial adventure. But with this kind of innovation, are flying bikes the new standard for personal transport? Number one, the Flyer, personal aircraft for everyday use. Finally, we have the Flyer, designed for those who dream of bypassing ground traffic altogether. This personal aircraft offers a tantalizing glimpse into a future where the sky is the limit. Equipped with advanced safety features and intuitive controls, it's accessible even to novice pilots. Imagine cruising above congested city streets, landing right where you need to be, all while avoiding traffic jams. It's not just a new form of transportation, it's a new level of freedom. Could this be how we'll travel in the cities of tomorrow? China's innovations are not just changing the game, they're rewriting the rules of transportation. From aerial trains to flying SUVs, the line between ground and sky is blurring. The question isn't if these technologies will spread worldwide, it's how soon. And as the US watches China's rapid advancements, one thing is clear. The future of transportation has already arrived and it's soaring high above our heads. If you enjoyed this amazing deep dive, like the video, share your thought in the comments and subscribe to channel and hit that bell icon to stay updated on more content like this. Thanks for watching.